Hi guys, Scotty Wild Outdoors. First of all, I want to say thanks very much for clicking on the video. Uh, tonight, as you can see from the thumbnail, we're having a little woodland camp. I'm out with Scott again. Uh, didn't do any filming coming in, we got here a bit late, so I just wanted to get a tent set up and uh, get some food on the go. Brought you back for the food though, should I say brought you in for the food. Uh, got some delights which I'll show you in a minute. To show you where we camp, the trusty OEX Fox 2 out again. Cracking wee tent. Last video, one before this, we were up Ben Woman Summit camping. Uh, 30 mile an hour, sorry, 30 kilometer an hour winds overnight. Didn't budge, didn't move. Fantastic wee tent. I think at the moment they're about 70 pounds. It's absolutely great value for money. Uh, it's a two man tent. Again, if you've read the reviews video, seen my review video, then you'd know that it is only big enough for one man. And say hi, Scott. Hi. <laughs> Scott's got the Bobcat OEX. Again, he had that up Ben Loman. Didn't budge at all. Uh, how much was yours, Scott? You used to reduce that to 60 now. 60 quid now. Oh, it got go outdoors, into it? Aye. Aye, right, so... Uh, Scott's got a wee bit of a porch area with his as well. Uh, it's just folded back at the moment. Uh, and you've got the the bottom bit, the floor space is well covered, which is good. So you maybe see some smoke. We decided to treat ourselves tonight, and um, we're going to have some spicy cheeseburgers with bacon. Get in. You're live, by the way. Candy camera. So guys, we've had dinner, just uh, sitting having a couple of drinks, having Jack Daniels and Coke. How you got Scotty boy? The old Fosters. So, the question is, if you don't take a drink with you when you're camping, are you, you really... <laughs> <laughs> are you really camping? <laughs> so, we're just in a bit of woodland, we've just came across, we went to an area, um, looked on Google Maps, found the... Found a wee spot, uh, walked along, came off, the, came off the trail a bit and uh, found a, a quiet bit of woodland. So, uh, apart from getting eaten alive with the midge, we're out in force tonight, there's no wind. Uh, it's quite a nice wee spot, quite peaceful. No wind, no rain at the moment. Touch wood, we are in Scotland so I've just jinxed it. So, <laughs> but the thing is what I talk about guys, <clears throat> we're having a, having a discussion about food. And I don't know if you've seen the last video, but we were meant to be on uh, Ben, well we were on Ben Lohan, but we were meant to have a, a cook at the summit. Uh, we're going to have a mixed grill. We'll get steaks, bacon, sausage, ba bacon, sausage um, gammon, no gammon, pork, pork chops, pork chops, pork chops eggs, full works on, on the summit at Ben Lohan. Uh, Mother Nature had a different idea though, it was windy as anything. We ended up just retreating back to the tents. Yeah. But the subject came up about steak. Now, I'm a firm believer if you have your steak done, uh, well done, then you should just eat chicken because you just ruined the steak. No, I'm a well done kind of guy. So, <laughs> Scott, Scott was right, your steak well done. So in a sense, I'm, I'm glad we didn't get to cook because I think it would have fell out. But um, you might you might see a wee flame in the, the side of us there. I've got a wee fire log on the barbecue at the moment, try to get rid of the midge. Yeah. Show you that. Again guys, we will take everything home with us tomorrow. Leave no trace as always. So we've set up a little basher as well, as we are in Scotland, and just in case it does actually rain, we can just sit under that. Uh, I mean, as great as the OEX tents are, there's no really much room to sit in them in terms of talking to each other and stuff when it's raining. So Scott Used to be in the TA and had a, was it called a basher? Basher poncho. Basher poncho. So apparently you wear it, I'm sure, sure a few of you will know what it is. Um, you wear it as well as turn it into a tarp as well, pretty handy, put a kit. Yeah, uh, you had that fairy TA then or? Aye, it was a shield. Was it? It was a shield. How long was that then? Oh, I'm going back about 18 years now. 18 years and the same bit of kit, wow. Mm -hmm. Still there. Fair enough. Make sure it doesn't go on fire then. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
Yeah, guys, so what do you think of the, the Woodland Camp videos? Um, give everybody a little thumbs up if you agree it's a good idea. We were going to go up Ben Ann, uh, but the weather was not looking too good. It was looking good all week. And then it, it changed yesterday and today driving up towards Ben Ann, it, it just it started teeming down. So we, we wanted more of a camp this time than, than a, a walk. Yeah, we'd done the walk the last time. We just wanted a few beers, uh, chill out. Get get a bit of a catch up, bit of a celebration. We're both we're both truck drivers. Scott Scott's a big truck driver now. <laughs> Pass, passed his test today, so we're having a wee celebration drink. Um, hey yeah, guys, any any questions about the the OEX tent? I've had some good feedback on the my Instagram page. If you're not following me, that's Scotty Wild Outdoors. Um, a lot of guys are are, are praising the OEX tents. Um, again, it stood up really well. They're, they're, they're sturdy. You know, they, they look, they're smart looking tents, they blend in with the background as well. Yeah, as long as you've not got my door open because it's orange, just inside of yours. See them? The orange. orange as well, aye. Shutters are down, you won't, you won't see it though. Hey uh, guys, grab a few beers and uh, talk to you later on. Cheers. So we campsite for the night. Looking, looking quite nice actually. We, we all get the back there, get a wee fire going. We shelter for the rain. It's not been raining though. Pretty good. With a wee shower, that was it. Aye. Some firewood. Happy days, people. So again, guys, if you are watching this, don't just be the person that sits and watches the videos. If you want to do it, get out there and do it. There's nothing better than being out here. So we're saying driving up, um, didn't go to plan what we are going to do, but we, we both agreed we'd rather be out doing this, driving about, looking for a campsite, looking for somewhere to camp, somewhere to go, than sitting in, watching TV on a Friday night, or out in the pub. Especially now with the Covid, it's just, it's just not the same is it, it just, it's not good. Um, and here we are, middle of the woods. Little, little fire. I mean, we fire. Tents. Now, to me, that'd be sitting on the couch watching the telly. But I say, if you are, you are, you are want to do this, don't just say you want to do it. These tents, like, Scott's bobcat, two totally different tents, same make. Scott's. Let's get more of a porch area. Mines. More of a low profile. Tent. The Scottish tent at the moment. So I've got eaten alive with the midge. So I've got the fire on because the midge are horrendous. Uh, Scottish tent, £60 as I said. Mines I think it's about £70. Mines are two man, Scots are one man. You've got a bit more room in mine, but you can sit up in Scots. So it's just really whatever. You can sit up in mine, but you can sit out and actually cook in the porch in Scots as well. Um, anyway, I think he's opening it up for us. Have we got a Scotty boy? You see the little porch area there. Sleeping compartments obviously with the oranges. Uh, obviously with mine. Not really got a porch area as such. Or a, a floor space anyway. But yeah, they are 60, 70 pounds, guys. Now, in terms of tents, you might think that's cheap, but it is really cheap. But take it from me and Scott, I said before, we put it through put it through its paces last weekend anyway, and it held up well, didn't it budge? Great tents, absolutely fantastic for the money. Um, don't believe, take care word for it, go on to my Instagram, Scotty Wild Outdoors. Uh, there's guys on there commented as well. Yeah, I'm saying that they're absolutely great tents. So I keep uh, touch myself, get eaten alive here with midges. Fly it back to the smoke. Um yeah guys, you don't have to spend a fortune to get out there. Um the thing I would say though, one thing you don't want to scrimp on is your sleeping bag and your mat. Yeah, I'm going to upload a wee video of our mats, the uh, Trekology mats. Fantastic. I got one, showed it to Scott our first camp out, loved it, got it one in sale. Worth the money, I think they're about £40, I believe. Um, 
And we've just got a wee summer sleeping bag at the moment because it is pretty warm. It's only got to drop to about 10 tonight. But yeah, guys, um, speak to you soon. Got to go and have another beer. Get ready in a midge. Morning, guys. How are we? It's about quarter to five, and we had a great night's sleep actually. Your Scott getting up now. Go get up, get some breakfast, and get packed up, and head home and go go to Adult Disneyland today. Go outdoors. Can't wait to do that. Go and waste some money. Buy stuff we don't need. Yeah, uh, yeah. Let's get this day started. Coffee this morning, some nice cafe gold, caramel, latte. It's only about 80 pence for about 7 or 8 out of Aldi, I believe it is. Fantastic wee coffees. Handy as well, but it's in the wee packet. She's really carrying loads of things about with you. Sweet enough as well, just because of the caramel to it. Breakfast guys, good old Scottish square sausage, Get in. steak sausage, give me a thumbs up in the video if you've tried this, leave a wee comment if you like it, obviously Scott's from Sunderland, so he didn't know the beauties of square sausage until he came up, he absolutely loves the stuff now. So I get the rolls, we M&S rolls, not just any rolls boys and girls, M&S rolls, listen to the sizzle. Oh. Look at that people, square sausage in the morning, is there a better breakfast item? I don't think so. Let me know what your thoughts are if you've tried it. It's the Englishman's verdict. Lovely. <laughs> Well guys, that's us all packed up, ready to go, had breakfast as you've seen, delicious, no tried square sausage, get yourselves up to Scotland and get it, you'll no regret it, oh tatty scone, have a tatty scone and uh, square sausage for breakfast, brown sauce, so 
as always guys what is it doing ah. as always guys leave no trace my tent was there that's our bag of rubbish we're taking home with us Scotty boy's tent was there and our little shelter slash barbecue fire was there again guys doused it in water covered it over you'd never know we were here so we were saying I think we found a little regular camp spot discreet no one will find it that's it cracking wee bit hey guys that's the end of the video if you made it this far thanks very much for watching hope you've enjoyed it uh, if you would like to see more of this just uh, put a little like on the video put it in the comments we will be finding an our camp very soon We've done our couple of review videos as well on the Trekology UL80 mat, fantastic bit of kit, uh, great night of sleep on it both times that we've uh, used it now, even with the, the wind at Ben Lomond. If you haven't done so already guys, please do hit subscribe, uh, probably be up there, and give the video a little like guys, show the support, and if you haven't done so already again, run over to Instagram, it's Scotty Wild Outdoors. Give us a little follow there, see what we're up to day to day, um, and news and upcoming videos, things like that. Hope you have a great weekend, guys. See you soon. Cheers.